Hey friend, look, today we are going to be doing something a little bit different. Um, I have fallen in love with Kamra. Kamra. This is a bottle of Tapa. It was under $50, but it's giving bougie, expensive, okay? So that led me to want to do combos with this perfume, okay? And body mist today. We're going to only do some body mist. I feel like there's way more, but the ones I've been playing with, Let's go ahead and talk about it. So in case you have not heard of this, this perfume has cinnamon, nutmeg, bergamot, dates, praline, tuberose, tonka bean, vanilla, and baby. It is giving. Do you hear me? Long lasting, beautiful, beautiful silage. So good i know y'all been hearing all the girls talk about this okay it gives like a warm pie mm, just sweet luscious but kind of boozy even though there's no alcohol in this it kind of gives me that boozy vibe you guys so look i have been playing with some body mist that you can layer with this because i love these type of videos i need to know all the kind of body mist i can layer with this one perfume i'm only going to give you a few I feel like there's a lot more, but let's just talk about the ones that I got. So friends, some of these combos are not going to be what you would expect to pair with this, okay? So first of all, let's just get that out the way. <laughs> but the first one I want to talk about is Fairy Tale with Kamra. You guys, I was shocked. Okay, so Fairy Tale has pomegranate nectar, fresh orange blossom, vanilla bean, and warm amber, okay? But baby... These two together, it smells so good. Oh my goodness. Now, I have not worn these combos out. I have not worn them out. But baby, I've been trying and playing. And it's just so good because I still, I get both of them. It's like two scents put together. They don't blend all into one note, okay? It's not like that. I can smell both of these. I can smell, and they go together. I can smell the camera and I can smell the fairy tale distinctly put together. Try them out. It's good. Okay, friend, this next one shocked me too, girl. It shocked me, okay, because I used eye sugar plum. All right, so the notes in it is sparkling sugar plum, snowdrop petals, and whipped marshmallow. But when you pair it with camera, it gives the blueberry baked pie. Try it out, girl. Try it. If you have these two, honey, I was like, I smell blueberries. It smells like a blueberry muffin, blueberry pie, blueberry cake. There's no blueberries in the notes. I don't know if it's the, the dates and the praline with the uh, plum. I don't know. I don't know what it is. But try this out. And it gives blueberry pie, blueberry cake. Girl, I hope you got this camera because everybody is wearing it now. And it's very inexpensive. I know the price is going to go up because, and look at the bottle, look at the size. It's so good, you guys. I paired with these two. It's amazing. You got to try it. Okay, so here's another good one. And that's Ice Lemon Pound Cake. Y'all know it has sugar, glazed icing, um, pure lemon zest, and fluffy pound cake. It's giving another dessert. It's giving another dessert, okay? Y'all gotta try this. This smells so good. It's giving a deeper, deeper tone. It's still like, I can still smell the lemon ice lemon pound cake, but it's richer. It's like the richest ice lemon pound cake ever. Try these out, girl. Y'all gotta try these combos, honey. Hey, girl. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Uh-uh, you have got to try Pretty as a Peach with this camera. It's giving baked peach pie. It's giving baked peach pie. Y'all, it smells so good. I don't know what's going on around here. I don't know what's going on. I don't know, but it is so good. Do you hear me? Y'all. It's giving delectable, delicious, baked peach pie. Mm, mm, mm. 
girl, this camera is it's it's doing things. It's doing big things. Okay, so next up is another good one. It's not gourmand to me. It's not gourmand, but it's into the night. So y'all know this has amber and wild beer, wild berries. I think it's some jasmine. I'm not sure, but I think it has jasmine in it. And pair it with this. It's just pretty. This just gives pretty. So if you're not into gourmand sweet, try pairing it with this. It definitely cuts down the cinnamon. I don't know a lot of people say they're not feeling the cinnamon, okay? So you can either accentuate that cinnamon or you can pull it back. This is definitely pulling it back. And it's just a pretty, pretty combo. It's really pretty, but not cinnamony, not gourmand, not super sweet, but it's pretty. So another good one is Fall in Bloom. Now, this Fall in Bloom is no joke, baby, all right? Because y'all know Kamer is strong, but these two together, you still, you still pulling out their Fall in Bloom, okay? So this has Juicy Plum, uh, Wild Blooms, and Velvet Moss. Use definitely, this is still the definite, definite aggressor in this combo but it's pretty together it's pretty together i smell both of these but to me this still comes out as the top notes but it's really really good so if you like falling blooms try layering it with camera it's good get it back to the grandmines okay this one is giving me buttercream cinnamon cupcake or cookie okay yeah this right here Okay, so this is Cupcake Swirl, and the notes in this is buttercream, and then it has ginger, clove, cookies, butter, vanilla, coconut, and musk. But they go so good together. It's definitely giving a buttercream, cinnamon, cupcake, cake, or cookie. Mm, that's a strong combo right there. It's a strong gourmand strong on mine okay y'all i gotta pair this stuff it's good friend if you're an amber lover you gotta try this and that's the sensual amber because this has amber and it has you know those wild berries it has that fruity scent this has amber too and it has fruity notes it, along with other things but these two pair beautifully and it really really brings out that amber if you love amber you gotta try this this is for the one who loves those boozy you know liquor notes and that would be the sweet whiskey now i was surprised by this one this pairs are really good together they pair really really good i definitely pick up the, that whiskey note in it but it's not strong it's not strong it's very tempered and it just smells really good so if you're not into the sweet sweet gourmand you're like a little more boozy pair these two yeah, have you guys ever smelled like a pumpkin pecan pie yes pumpkin pecan waffles and karma is definitely giving pumpkin pecan pie oh. y'all oh my goodness i can't even tell you which one is my favorite but y'all know I love gourmands. Y'all know I love the sweets, baby. We're going to be doing some full combos with these. So good. So good, girl. So good. Next one for pistachio lovers. Oh, boy. Y'all. Charosa number 62. Charosa number 62. This is... It brings out that pistachio. Oh my goodness. It amplifies it. It amplifies the pistachio for me. Oh my goodness. Y'all, if you're into gourmand, you like expensive smelling fragrances, but you're on a budget. If you got around $50, I'm going to link this down below. Y'all need to go order this. You need this in your life, okay? This is, it's probably not a blind buy because I don't know that everybody's going to love this because it's rather strong. Some people like airy, lighter scents, but I do too. I'm that type of person, but there's these last few perfumes 
I mean, it's giving. It's giving. It's perfect for summer. It's going to last. It's beautiful. And if you like Grimmons, it's just taking them to the next level. And this is that for me. I'll leave the link down below in case you're interested. I wish you could smell it before you buy it because I don't want to spend anybody's money. I know money's tight nowadays. I don't want you spending your money because of me. But if you could sniff this some kind of way, oh yeah, you need to try it out. Maybe get you a sample. I don't know if they got samples anywhere or not, but I would recommend the sample first to see if you like it and then buy it. This can go on and on, but this is gonna be my last one. Okay, so this is number 71, Brazilian Crest Chirosa 71, paired with Camera. Okay, this one, I don't like as much as 62. It's good though. It, it's good. It's more macadamia. Like I said, it's just amplifying the main note in these Chirosas to me. It's definitely amplifying it. It's good, but I think I love Pistachio. And this is magnificent. So good. You guys, you got to try some of these out. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you have the camera. Have you tried mixing and pairing it? I'm also going to make a video on perfumes that I want to wear with camera. But these are just some of the body mints because I got a feeling that this will go with a lot. I think it's gonna go with a lot of stuff, but I absolutely adore it, okay? So I'm about to go film my video for tomorrow, and that's gonna be combos that I wore last week, so make sure you look out for that. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave me some comments down below. Let me know, have you tried any of these combos? And which ones you thinking about trying? If you have some of these at home, try putting them together and let me know. So that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please make sure you're subscribed. I hope I see you guys tomorrow. Take care.